Interesting. You know, I have an editor that I pay in the Philippines, speaking of inflation, $150 every two weeks. And that comes out to like 8,000 something in his money. Or it's usually around 8,000. The last time I sent him 150 and it sent him $8,200. And he was like, hey man, thanks for the bonus. And I was like, what? I didn't pay you anything different. So what does that mean? Does that mean our currency is getting weaker? Or stronger, stronger because I'm giving him more for less. Foreign. So his currency is weakening. Foreign exchange market. You're, you're, you're in the foreign exchange market. Congrats. Uh, I, would, yeah. I, would, I would type in the number of their currency over the number in your currency. One, whatever, whatever it's called. USD to Filipino peso. 55 this dollars interesting interesting this current and, this first century bc roman damn a month ago it was 53 no wonder i gave him more money yeah what's going on over there currencies fluctuate everyone woke up one day and was like yo your russia's also your oil plug that's our oil plug why do we all have the same oil plug that's pretty nice. Do you think I should um, go to Russia to get your own oil? Be self-sufficient? No, I was going to say, do you think I should just like, pay based on uh, inflation? Do you think companies should do that? Do you think companies should pay more because things are rising? Workers will want that until companies will say, you can't get a job unless you do this. And there's some recession yeah. happening. Because if you think about it, prices have been rising for the past hundred years and the wages oh, are still okay. relatively the same. People got hundred thousand dollars in the past. Well, no, That's right. but like now the, like for what you get a hundred thousand dollars for probably affects more people. Right. And creates more money. So like, you're not gonna be a software engineer. 100 years ago and today software software engineering job can make a whole shit ton of money so it's easier to get 100 grand yeah you know so like but like let's say i don't know besides like minimum wage let's say i'm something that did exist 100 years ago like a fucking coal miner or something they got paid less and, than they do now and what's up what'd you say they got paid less than they do now because of Currency. They probably got paid ten dollars for a month. This is exaggeration, but in the past people got paid less money because there was less inflation. Yes. Yes. But like but that is that in proportion to like the amount of money being created? I don't really think so. And also does it need to be? Uh, probably not. Depend if you want the talent to make you money, then you will have to think about giving talent money. Yeah, I'm just gonna pay him the same. <laughs> Too much work. It is a it's a thing. Make it make a system where you would be joyous to be in it. I'm joyous. First century BC, dude, these cats were like, hey, dude, this is silver. Less valuable, less silver in here. It's darker. What are we doing, Romans? 90 BC, denarii were pure silver. Then it was cut like cocaine with increasing amounts until the cheaper metal constituted up to 14% of the coin's contents. Your local pharmaceutical cocaine makers just doing what the Romans did. It's just a little bit of, you know, inflationary. <laughs> 